so it's 7 31 um, p.m. so I just finished eating my veggie stew which is good I'm working on that so what I've been doing recently and like yesterday and today is I've been uh, limiting my social media use uh, so for example yesterday night I turned off the computer and you know just just sitting here and doing nothing um, I feel like it's really helping my mental health because um, I think I've been very addicted to social media and uh, I spend almost the, my overwhelming amount of the time I spend on the internet watching videos Twitch, YouTube, uh, Facebook, <laughs> I say videos of Facebook, you know, Black Lives Matter stuff. Um, but um, I know, but that, that, that's where I neglect my own life, and this has been going on for almost a decade now. Uh, before, I think I started using uh, YouTube when I was 30, uh, you know, so almost uh, a decade, I think. So t for today, for instance, I didn't use the internet throughout the whole afternoon and into the evening, and I was just lying in my bed, and you know I just felt really calm, like you know. Um, another thing I'm trying to do is like you know not do things, for instance. So I just sit there, or when I'm lying in my, in my bed, I'm just lying there. I'm not tr I'm not trying to read anything. I'm trying to do something. I'm just sitting there and just listening to the. Uh, sounds of the room or and then there were moments when I felt so relaxed I felt so relaxed so it's like that slow living <laughs> you know they, they, they have this thing called a slow living movement I heard um, anyway this is video I'll link below you know, where, where this, um, this YouTube will talk about uh, detoxing from social media and uh, I think there's a there's a lot uh, a lot of good um, advice there. Um, uh, I think it, for me, especially, I, I think I because of the way I consume social media, it's, it's almost like it's taking over my life. Where you know, I spend almost a, so I'm I'm doing this thing uh, where I'm trying to let go of my <laughs> addiction to social media, and uh, like today was good because I, I didn't use the social media for the majority of the afternoon and so I'm just like I just uh, so instead of using social media I just don't I, I do nothing and because of my uh, I feel like because I wasn't uh, using uh, using social media I could actually for instance focus on my room like I, I cleaned a little bit I think I cleaned it. Anyway, um, but I made my veggie stew and you know it's helping me to and it's also good, uh, um, it's also helping me deal with my anxiety because I was, uh, when I was lying in bed there are moments when I was thinking about <laughs> social media stuff and I'm like I was starting to get anxious because I felt like oh you know that FOMO I think uh, that was mentioned in one of the videos. Uh. Anyway <sighs> So like, I, I feel like, oh my god, what if I I have to follow? That's another thing when you're on social media, you feel like you have to follow everything, follow everything, otherwise you, 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 you know. So I, I had to let go of that. So I have to tell myself, you know, I have to just let this go and, you know, just uh, gradually come back into this world. Because before, you know, when I started using social media so heavily, you know, before in my twenties, it's not like I was on social media. You know, uh, I listened to a few podcasts, but I wasn't like uh, an avid user as I have recently become. And you know, and I want to go back to a place where I'm living in the in this world because I feel like I feel more calmer. Uh, you know, so what I'm doing right now is actually limiting my social media use and I feel like it's uh, uh, helping, me. helping me so yeah